as I promised, I am going to be showing you the new grounds of Ivy Tower. I won't be doing a tour of the whole tower again. Um, that will be linked at the end of the video if you want to watch it. But yeah, so this is going to be a pretty short video. I'm just showing you around the updated version, and it is a lot cheaper now. Um, but yeah, so um, I'll get into it. Quick little run up. I did do some minor changes in the tower itself. Like in the penthouse, I might have changed a chair. Or maybe the doors to the balcony. Stuff like that. I didn't do too many differences. But it did update the tower slightly. Um, if you notice the colour of it. I don't know if you will. I did actually change the colour to a lighter tone. Because the tower was quite dark. With all these colours going up. But I've changed it to a lighter colour. Throughout the whole thing. Which I can't. Can I show it from here? You can see at the top. It's not black with the sign anymore. So that might be. I also took into consideration what some people said and i added some supports for the helipad um but yeah so it's got a little bit less gold in the in the vault i wouldn't say the bunker in the vault it's got a little bit less gold um which helps lower the price as well and it's now got the large plot size so coming straight out the back here where you have the little archway which was originally the entrance to the beach you have a lake over here and in a fair in my defense like it was kind of rushed in a way because i wanted it done but i have done a lot of detail as well over here you'll see there is a golf ball from the golf course and i believe i put some in here yep, there's golf balls everywhere <laughs> just like you would have if it was right next to a golf course this is the basic golf course i created i thought i'd try it i've never built one before I could have probably put some more effort into the golf club, but I think that turned out alright. Like you can tell what, what it's meant to be. Resting up against the rock there, and then that little box to hold your golf ball. I think it's called a putt. No, is that... It might not be called a putt. That might be actually a golf club name. I'm not sure. It's the little thing that you put the golf ball on. But yeah, so and then over here I created like a sand pit where... I think you've all seen it, where it's really hard to get the golf ball out, put it in the sand. Don't know really why they're kind of like sinking into the sand. I think I did originally make it so they were above the sand, but I'm not sure what happened. But that doesn't affect the way it looks. Um, on the right hand side, when you come through the entrance, you come to a large swimming pool slash bar. You could also cook your food out here, which is great. Serve it up on the nice little tables over there. Running down, you have your laptop. You can actually sit on some of these as well. I glitched a bench in so you can just sit and relax running straight down you have your swimming pool your towels and this is my favorite part of the pool area you've got the little sun beds which you can shut the curtains and relax let me try my best <gasps> nope that's not working ah okay so there is a way to shut the curtains i think it's all about angles i'm really bad at my angles um but yeah so it does give you a lot of privacy there you don't shut the ones here because you're obviously looking out at the swimming pool and the beautiful tower it's given me a very big resort vibe. A lot of people assume this is a hotel. But this was actually made as an apartment building. And I've always called it like a town in the tower. Because it has everything from stores, restaurants, everything. So I get why people might think, oh yeah, it's a hotel. But you can use it as a hotel. You can use it for whatever you want. But I personally made this entire tower just because I wanted a penthouse at the top. I couldn't bear the idea of living in a penthouse in an empty tower. So I built an entire tower entire like 20 floor tower just for the penthouse running along if we have time at the end i will quickly run up and have a look at the penthouse just to show you like the minor changes here you have a maze originally i was going to put like a bathroom down here but i didn't really get to that i didn't think there was much point in doing that because you have one in like the apartment building lobby straight there like, the maze leads out to the tennis court and straight down here you have a tennis court this is like the two tennis courts there's another one up there on the terraced balcony kind of thing the garden i don't know sky garden no no um it's like a little garden area over there just above the entrance there's a tennis court there but yeah so you have a larger tennis court here which is a shame you don't have a tennis court like mini game where you can like hit the tennis balls like with a certain key that would be brilliant especially considering so many people use tennis courts to fill in gaps or make the house more luxurious okay so if I run straight down here, I've got to run quickly because I've got to get to the other end. You have more like the transport section. You have a 
runway so you can land your plane and the little warehouse at the end is built so if you drive in there slowly with your plane you can turn it around it's got angled walls to help you turn it opposite side you have two extra helipads i think that makes it two i think there's four helipads in total it's a shame you can't support more than one but yeah you've got one for the penthouse one on the roof for like guests and two down here i guess for more guests and then down there is just the door out to where the beach will be i guess it's built it's mainly built to go like a beach plot you can go wherever you want but it was originally built to go on like a beach plot so you can go through the gates and you have the ocean view okay so i'm gonna quickly go up to the penthouse and just show you like the slight change i made i really didn't do too much all i did was like change a couple doors i think i moved a table in one of the apartments because you couldn't really get in oh no can i even do this <gasps> did i do it I did it without having to do it, okay. So this is the penthouse, it's pretty much the same as before. All I've done is change that chair to like red leather. Um, oh, stuck. And then I added a beam around there so it's not so, like, not such a flat like roof looking at it. Because if you came out here, you'd look at it and it'll just be like flat. And I'm like, that's not, that's not really what I want. So I added a beam to extend it. And there's a change of color, making it all a little bit lighter. I did remove a lot, oh that was a big touch, I did remove a lot of the plants growing up the side of the building just because the bushes didn't look that good anymore considering how far the game has come, we have ivy and stuff like that, I did keep some of it, as you can see there, I kept some of the, I can't say it, some of the exfoliant, no that's exfoliant, some of the foliage, is that the right word? God I'm really struggling with my English today, but yeah and then over here all I've done this bit is, oh is create like a double door kind of thing like an open door look i actually managed to create that in one of my more recent builds that i'm working on and i really love the way it looks it's just like a door that's been pushed open and then yeah i've just that's really all that's changed here i'll have a quick upstairs i'm pretty sure that's all that i've changed i kept the bedroom the same that's the same the only thing that I can really remember that I definitely changed is I had someone that had an issue with people turning off the power when this was turned to a party and sadly with big builds sometimes the power goes off it doesn't go back on so I've removed the power switch from the office and kept the one in the ground floor staff office but it's now got lasers across it so um, people that like come into your party can't get in there so no one can turn off the power apart from you, which I think is going to be really helpful for people that use this in their parties. And yeah, so this is like the view you get from here. And again, this is why I built it as a beach plot. Like again, it looks great here. I'm saying the word again, I got. It looks great here because you can see all the way around. I'm sure, I'm sure when it's not foggy, you can see even further. But you get ocean view, you get view of the city sometimes, and it just works out great. So yeah, I hopefully you like this. I'll put the new code below and thank you for watching.